Ladies and gentlemen, I am proud to announce that Duralius and Associates is officially open for business. Huzzah. There's only like six of us here, Duralius. Okay. And there's no ladies. We're still open for business. Well, it's not really a grand opening if it's just. Did I say it was a grand opening? Well, it's, it feels it's an like opening. A, feels like a grand opening. Zipatas. From this day forward, anyone living in fear, anyone being oppressed, anyone losing their grip on freedom will have someone to turn to. They can turn to Duralius and Associates for a small fee. Or a big fee, right, fellas? <laughs> oh, whatever they can afford. <laughs> Cheers, everyone. Cheers. 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 Guys, I worked a long time on that speech, so. Thorellius, I pledge my axe to you. Oh, here we go. And this wonderful cause. Axe kisser. And now, from now on, our minds are shared. We have the same brain from here on out. Don't we need, like, more people? Sure, but a small, highly skilled team can be just as effective. Like Bruf here. When he served under King Legapur and they were at war, he didn't fight alongside the thousands of men in their army, did you, Bruf? We only had nine. That's still three more than we have. We're going to get more men. That would be pleasant. See, like big armies are clumsy, they're predictable, they're obvious. Bruf's team was special, and this team is also special. And the advantage that we have is that we don't have all the red tape of a monarchy weighing us down. Mm Mm-hmm. Or good weapons. The horses. We are going to get weapons, and we've got weapons right now. Sure, it'd be nice to have more, but we've got enough to get started. Yeah, but what about the horses? I mean, I mean, not only are they pretty, but damn it, you know, we can get around a lot faster. How about a shield? Or trebuchet. Funny word. Trebuchet. It is. Keep saying it. Trebuchet. Trebuchet. One more time. Trebuchet. Everybody. Trebuchet. Trebuchet. Okay, sh- shut up. Dralius, if you really want to annihilate your enemies, what you need... It's the Zephyr Blade. <laughs> the Zephyr Blade's just a myth. Oh! Duralius! It's no way to talk. Zephyr Blade's real. Guarded by the Lady in the Lake. Yeah, but even if it is real, uh, you can't just go up and grab the Zephyr Blade. Don't you have to be like the Chosen One or something? Oh, come on! What have you got to lose? Go to the lake. Ask the broad for the sword. You're right, Sir Walken. It is worth a shot. All right. Here we are. Are we just staying here? I don't know. Maybe we should call out for the Lady of the Lake. Not a bad idea. Lady! No, 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 no. The right of us. I think we should all do it. I mean, if four people are yelling, it's bound to get some. Let's energy. do it together, yeah. I, mean, yeah. I think that'd be good. Hey, oh, lady, 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 where are you? Lady, 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 lady of the lake. She's Come like, out here, lady. Now that's just going to scare her away. What's up with the creepy voice, Murdon? It's, not, it's my regular voice. Huh? Hey, lady. Lady. That's, lady. Like lady. that's like saying, that's like saying don't come, Murdon. Yeah, I'm a stalker. Something's happening. Duralius, I am the Lady of the Lake. Step forward, for you are the Chosen One. I'm the Chosen One? I'm the Chosen One. Are the chosen one? <laughs> are you kidding me? Behold, Duralius, the mighty Zephyr Blade. That's the Zephyr Blade? Yes. This is a tiny little little dagger. No. This is the legendary Zephyr Blade. Imagine it a lot bigger, didn't you guys? Well, I, if you don't want it, I'll take it. I mean, I'm gonna take it, but I just, you know, I didn't picture Well, quit bitching about it. Just sure you'll take it, brother. What can I, what, what, what do I have to do? Take the Zephyr Blade from my hand. Go forth into the forest and slay the beast that lies within the darkness. That's fine. Guys, I can do this. Um, all right, I'm going to take the Zephyr Blade, this Zephyr Blade in my hand, and go kill that beast. Back this way? Be brave, Duralius. Okay, I'm going. You can do it. Okay. Pretty sure this isn't the Zephyr Blade. 
You are wise, Duralius. That is not the Zephyr Blade. But I asked specifically for the Zephyr Blade. That is far too small to be the Zephyr Blade. I know that. I said that. I said it was like a tiny dagger. You did not say that. Bro. I said that's a small dagger. That's you not said the that's a tiny dagger? I just got my ass kicked by that giant ass beast and this freaking dagger bent. Can I get the real Zephyr Blade, no, please? She, she pulled that out and you went crazy ape shit over it like you were it, happy about it. And now you're acting like you don't even appreciate it. She told me it was the Zephyr it. Blade. You told me it was the Zephyr Blade. Behold, Duralius. The true Zephyr Blade. Now that looks like a Zephyr Blade. All right, that's a biscuit. No, it is the Zephyr Blade. So you're, you're eating the Zephyr Blade. Yes. All right, I'll tell you what. You go ahead and eat that Zephyr Blade, bring your ass back down into that water, and get me the real Zephyr Blade, okay? As you wish. You know, I was set on fire back there. My bad. Dralis, you're being kind of rude. Yeah, but she... You, you have no idea what I just went through. Yeah, but she's a lady. I know. How do you know that wasn't the Zephyr Blade? That thing was freaking huge. What, what, I... This? No, the biscuit. Have you seen the Zephyr Blade? No, but I'm pretty sure it's not a Zephyr Biscuit. Well, now she's going to bring a fake Zephyr Blade because you pissed her off. She was eating that Zephyr Blade, Neebs. Behold, DeLorean. It's Duralius. That's what I said. Behold, DeLorean, the mighty Zephyr Blade. And that's a, that's a tree branch. No, for this is truly the Zephyr Blade. All right, um, you know what, forget it, because i uh, got a whole tree full of Zephyr Blades back home, and I'll just grab one of those. But uh, yeah, thanks for nothing. And uh, all the, uh, the wounds, I appreciate that too. Come on, guys, let's go. So that was our day. So we're just going to give up, DeLorean? 